In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for BaNO32, barium nitrate. Barium, that's a metal, and then nitrogen and oxygen, those are nonmetals. They're bound together tightly in what we call a polyatomic ion. It's called the nitrate ion, and we have two of these nitrate ions. When we have a metal and nonmetals, we have an ionic compound. That means that the metal will transfer electrons to the nonmetals. So let's write Ba in the center, and then we'll write the NO3 on either side. So we have two of them. Barium is in group 2 on the periodic table. That means it has two valence electrons. So when it transfers two electrons, it loses two negative charges. It becomes 2 plus. When this nitrate here, it gets one of those electrons. Electrons are negative. It has a negative charge. And then the other electron goes here. And then this NO3 is negative as well. These negatives and positive, they're attracted to each other. And that's what forms the ionic bond in barium nitrate. Let's replace the nitrate ion here with a Lewis structure. We should put brackets around each of the nitrate ions. And you often see brackets around that metal ion, the cation. And that makes this the Lewis structure for barium nitrate. What we've drawn is what's called a formula unit. Normally, barium nitrate is a crystal. And it's made up of a bunch of formula units in a regularly repeating pattern. This is Dr. B with the Lewis structure for BaNO32, barium nitrate. And thanks for watching.